Scouts, and happy holidays. This Friday marks the one week till winter break. And the 30th is Bacon Day. Or Monkey Day is on the 14th. And on the 15th, it is Cat Herders Day. Also, Walt Disney was born on the 5th of December. And without Walt Disney, no Mickey. And without Mickey, no Disney Plus. And without Disney Plus, no Baby Yoda. So, thank you, Walt Disney. Yes. And now on to the announcements. December 9th is the 7th and 8th grade holiday choir concert. December 16th is the combined 6th grade Christmas concert, and that will include band, orchestra, and choir. School will, will resume on January the 2nd. And the last day of school before holiday break is Friday, December 20th. Bye. Welcome to Word on the Street. This week's Word on the Street is avalanche. Avalanche means a mass of snow, ice, and rocks falling rapidly down the mountainside. Don't you ever risk. Welcome to Opinions. The opinion is snow. One student says, I don't like snow because it's cold. Another says, I love snow because you can build with it. One teacher says, that's awful to drive on. Another says, I like it because my kids can play in it. Welcome to the Solcer segment. Today we are interviewing Ms. Solcer about coffee sales. Thanks for coming, coming to Scout Press today. Thank you for inviting me. So, we heard coffee sales went well. How's the money going to benefit Lewis and Clark? Well, there's actually a couple things. We went well over our goal for the sound system, so there is a little bit of money left in there. Uh, one of the things, though, is for sure that we will be able to pay for everybody's end of the year Blitz Day um, that have contributed. The other thing besides the sound system that we are looking at is a motivational um, speaker on social media next fall. We thought that would be um, a good contribution toward the all city is doing that assembly, and so that would be our contribution from Lewis and Clark. What are the benefits of a new sound system? Oh my gosh, first and foremost, probably safety, just because it's so loud in the gym and it's hard right now when the teachers need someone or we have an announcement or um, a, a call on the intercom, they don't always hear it. So once the teachers get that message, they can use the sound system to alert the people in the gym. And then just I think for overall gym fun and safety, you know, when kids are running and doing their warm ups and you switch directions, it's going to be easier to hear your teachers and things like that. And then games and announcing, we can start to have an announcer at our games, which none of the other schools do, so that might be kind of fun too. Do you enjoy doing coffee sales? I do enjoy it. It's a lot of work at the beginning, and I get a little afraid when we first see the bill. But then when kids start setting goals and drawing out of the prize box and competing and having fun with it, and so do the teachers, then it's lots of fun for me. Now, most importantly, did you buy any coffee? I did. I bought coffee from Elizabeth um, that's in Mrs. Sutton's room. She was the first one. I always say the first person to, to get me I'll buy from, and she is the first one for the last two years. So I've bought from her for two years. Thank you for coming to the Solstice segment, and we'll see you next time. Thank you.